Welcome to CCTV Camera Pro's Surveillance System Video Instruction Series. The following video demonstrates some of the capabilities of our PTZ Speed Dome camera and our IP video server. The IP video server converts any analog camera to an IP security camera by providing Ethernet video output and embedded video server software that supports remote access and controls for the PTZ camera over an IP network. The IP video server can be used to convert any CCTV camera to an IP security camera. The camera connects to the IP server with a standard male BNC connector. The IP server has both BNC and COT5 outputs, so you connect the IP server to a network as well as to an analog surveillance DVR. When the video server is connected to a network that is also connected to the internet, the IP server allows an operator to view and control the functions of the PTZ camera over the internet using Internet Explorer. We will start this demonstration now by opening Internet Explorer and navigating the, to the IP address of the video server. We are first prompt for the password. Once logged in, we will see the initial view that the camera is focused on. We will then switch to the PTZ camera controls so that we can move the camera. First, we pan the camera to the right. Then we tilt the camera view up. Next, we will use the zoom function of the camera to focus closely on a small object. As you can see, the camera automatically focuses very quickly after you adjust the pan, tilt, or zoom angle of the lens. Next, we zoom the camera's view back out and pan further to the right to view the front door. Next, we will demonstrate how to set up preset locations for the camera to adjust its view to. First, we adjust the camera view to the location that we want to configure a preset view for. Then we select the number of the preset, select a name for it, and press set. Let's move the camera view away so we can demonstrate how the server remembers the preset location. We select the preset location from the drop-down box and then press go. The camera quickly adjusts its view to the preset location. Here are some of the configuration options that the IP video server supports. On the system setting page, you can select the type of PTZ camera, the ID of the camera, and the baud rate that will be used. You can also set up the port that you want to use to connect your network and to communicate with the IP server. The time menu allows you to adjust the date and time of the IP video server, and the user setting screen allows you to add and remove users that have access to the server. This screen also shows you who is currently logged in. The motion and alarm screen allow you to configure your security camera to record and send alarms on motion detected events. You can adjust the sensitivity of motion detection using this drop down box. By setting up the mail settings section, you can configure the video server to send you an email alert when motion is detected by your camera. You can also configure the surveillance images to be transferred via FTP to a server that you designate by setting up the FTP settings. Let's go back to the camera view and demonstrate the PTZ capabilities one last time. With the zoom capability of the camera, we demonstrate here how well the camera can focus closely on objects. We are able to zoom in to the cover of this music book and see the faces on the cover as well as read the title clearly.
We hope that this video is helpful in demonstrating the capabilities of CCTV Camera Pro's PTZ security camera and IP video server. If you have any questions or would like to place an order, please visit us online at cctvcamerapros.com or call us at 888-849-2288. Thank you for watching.